yeah, it's important to me to like always like uplift people, man, because I remember what how dark a place it is when, you know, you're not, you're trying so hard and like everything around you is acting like you don't exist, you know? So when I get the chance to, you know, shine light on someone and say like, yeah, you are amazing at what you do. I don't see why I wouldn't want to do that. It's important for anybody who finds success to show other people where to find it. For my music in general, I want it to help and just ch be, give people a voice mm. because that's ultimately what we don't have when we're young. Yeah. Like, that's why people sometimes, we're not interested in politics or we're not interested in talking about anything because mm. we just feel like, why are we talking for? Mm. But you know, the music's getting out there, everybody's listening. I get it, man, I get it. And I'm happy, I'm happy and I'm conscious of it. You know what I'm saying? I try, I try to, you know, as much as I'm having fun on my records or messing around on my raps and that, I always remember, no, it's get me, you know what? People are looking to you for some sort of direction, right. man. So try and, as much as the lyric is like a, is gas try and put like some some truth in there, because it's, in there yeah it's needed everybody listening everybody who ever hears this anybody who ever you know in in any walk of life like if there's one thing i've learned it's definitely about just listening to that inner voice and it never leaves you it doesn't matter you go to sleep at night you try and tell it to shut up it's still talking you know what i'm saying it's always talking to you and like um yeah just just try and tap into that man like i said let's change the saying of you know um, listen to the voice at the back of your mind. It's not at the back of your mind. Like put it to the front, make it lead. You know, all the other stuff's irrelevant. Like that stuff can wait. You know, who you like and who you care, who's annoying you, or what you need to get, or you know your wants and stuff like that. Like that's that can go at the back. You know, the voice that's talking to you is telling you what you need, what you need. You know, so just follow it, man, and you know, really like aligning, aligning to that. And saying to myself, "Wow, I'm talking from I'm talking from like my uh, from inside my like inside my conscience, and it's reaching people. You know what I'm saying? And 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 that for me, once I realised that that could happen, I'm, is that what is that all I have to do? I was like, is that all I have to do? And I was like, that was it. It's one of those things, man. Sometimes that's why nowadays I don't even try and think too hard about lyrics because the best lyrics and the most catchy ones will just come to you. You don't have to think of them. It's more than like a song. It's more than like." This is a message, this is my emotion that I'm putting out to people and it's got so far that now I'm just floating, you know. I'm privileged to be able to preach the message, Yeah. you know. I'm privileged to be able to, to say it because now I'm freestyling. Before, if I would have made it, I shouldn't say made it, if I would have become successful in music doing something that wasn't me, now I have to keep up with something, you know. Now I have to chase, now I have to be like, oh, what's that thing that made me me then? I've got to keep referring back to that but now my enlightenment that I've had you know is become is come from myself yeah it's come from myself and it's actually happening inside me so now I just float you know and I just make sure and I'm around my friends like just tell them and always try and like bro you're a star you know find your find it find it because once you once you walk that it's it's that's it my mum hates when I talk about death yeah but I'm I'm actually, I used to always wonder why Biggie Smalls called his album Ready to Die. I didn't get it until the first time I said it to myself. When you live at one with yourself, at peace, in line with your mind, you go anytime. Because anybody who comes, my friends, my manager, my sister, my mum, anybody that comes in contact or speaks to me, they will know exactly what I think. They will know exactly what I want them to do. And everything's clear. There's no mixed messages. I'm good to go with anyone that I ever meet in my life, you know. And it's just, uh, I'm blessed, proud, grateful, all those appreciative words to be able to like see this. Keep dreaming big and everything that you see in your dreams can be real. You just got to work really hard and you see it come to fruition. At this point, you know, I'm just turning up to shows not knowing what the fuck's going to happen. I don't know. And I don't really care either. Like, these songs have got vibes on the stage on their ones, man, like on their own, with just me and Amanda. Man. If I can't get a show today or a club, I'm gonna go and do a show in a car park. I think it's very really similar to street art, or just jumping on a roof and finding somewhere to put your stuff and just hoping whoever sees it is gonna like it or hate it. I feel like, what, like when you make music, because it comes with music videos, it comes with outfits, it comes with styling, it comes with set design, I think just getting into art in different styles and formats of art is something that I come across, you know, I recognize it. I'm always excited to tackle it no matter what it is. Understand that in the midst of all these different styles, you can be yourself and that's where the success lies. I do think it's music and art that, you know, that changes the world. So, yeah, I try 
and like reach out to everyone. So I try to maintain a good balance. I try and put every emotion that I feel on different tracks. If someone gives me a beat and I feel like, yeah, this track is telling me to do this, I'll go on a track and do that. So it's like, I just let everyone just know who I am, fun, happy, sad, angry, everything. It's a beautiful thing, I don't know, music, man. I just, I'm, I'm just so happy that I found music, you know. I really find people that maybe can't dance or they don't, they don't feel music and stuff like that. And I'm like, wow, I don't understand what I'd even do without music. I don't get my life without music. It just sounds the same way a door shuts, the same way, you know, anything in the world, the wind, everything, it's just a sound. But now there's sounds out there that can feed me. Yeah or take care of me emotionally you know yeah. what i'm saying just a sound i got the best advice for me <laughs> i could talk to me about anything and i'll tell me the truth you know what i'm saying i don't want a best friend i don't want someone who's gonna use me or i don't want to use anyone else like i'm self uh sufficient, sufficient yeah. yeah and um and i believe the best relationships like i have loads of people that i love and it's only because they love themselves. And it's only because if something happened to them, they wouldn't blame me. You know what I'm saying? Or if, I, if something happens to me, I won't blame them. Or if there's something that we're not feeling right about, we don't say we're not talking to each other ever again. You have to have a real fucking clear vision of who you are. You have to protect yourself. Because the spotlight goes, man. I understand all this shit, but it's going to go into another rapper like soon, isn't it? Like, but. The only thing people remember about when a guy has a spotlight is what he did with it. Okay, what did you do like when it was your time? 